Hey guys, this is question MM059 for the Maths Methods Sharpen Study Guide. So we've got a function f uh, d to r f of x equals 2x squared, 2x cubed plus 5x squared take 24. Um, we want to find the domain for which that function will have an inverse. So we've got a bunch of options um, and you can see that they all have 5 on 3 or infinity, um, apart from r and d. So basically the question is, why would this function not have an inverse? Uh, and the reason is a function needs to be restricted to a one-to-one -one function in order to have an inverse function to exist. So from uh, negative infinity to negative five on three, this is all one-to-one, -one, which means that it would have an inverse. From negative five on three to zero, it would also have, this would also be a one-to-one -one function and from zero to infinity would also be a one-to-one -one function. So basically we need to see if there's any of those options in the multiple choice. So we pretty much want from here to there, from here to here, or from here onwards. Uh, we basically look through and see if any of those apply. So we've got negative five on three to infinity, uh, which is here to all the way across. Uh, but because that crosses this line, that means that it creates a many-to-one function uh, and that's not what we want. Uh, B is negative five on three to zero, which is from here to here, uh, which is actually what we want. So this would create a one-to-one -one function, uh, which means that the inverse function would exist and we'd have an inverse. So B is our answer, negative five on three to zero. So basically what you wanna do is find where the turning points are uh, and then work out sort of this little sketch down here and see exactly what would create a one-to-one -one, uh, function and that's your answer. So B is our answer.